A laser weapon is a weapon that uses a laser beam to irradiate a target and achieves destruction or interference through ablation, explosion, blinding, etc. It has many advantages, such as good directivity, high speed, high precision, low cost, free from electromagnetic interference and so on. Laser weapons can be used to strike targets in the air, on the ground, on the water, and even in space, such as drones, missiles, aircraft, satellites, and so on. On May 18, 2023, Russian Deputy Prime Minister Borisov announced a major news, a new generation of laser weapon system called Provocator was officially put into actual combat in eastern Ukraine. This move marks that the Russian army is about to equip this weapon. A tactical laser weapon. The Russian military began to use the Provocateur laser air defense system in Ukraine. Its main task is to intercept various types of drones and blind reconnaissance satellites, with a range of 5 kilometers. In addition, Russia also supplies the Perisvet laser weapon system on a large scale. Its range of action is even more impressive and can paralyze satellites in space orbit 1,500 kilometers above the ground. This news indicates that laser and electromagnetic weapons are gradually replacing traditional weapons and becoming mainstream in the next few decades. The reason why Russia urgently needs laser weapons is that it is expensive to intercept drones with traditional anti-aircraft missiles. While the price of civilian drones made in China is relatively low, which makes anti-aircraft missiles no longer cost-effective. Therefore, laser weapons become a cost-effective option. The new generation laser weapon system Provocator is mainly used to combat drones. Its small size allows it to be easily installed on drones or armored vehicles. According to reports, this laser weapon can intercept low-altitude targets within a range of 5 kilometers. With a continuous illumination time of 5 seconds, a working time of 100 seconds after each reload, and an output laser power of 50 kilowatts. The working principle of the laser weapon is to burn out the target's internal sensors, causing the drone to lose its function and burn it almost instantly. The Russian military said this was the actual use of tactical lasers in Europe's largest war. However, Russia is not the only one using laser weapons. Earlier, the Saudi Air Defense Force also used the Chinese-made Silent Hunter laser weapon to successfully intercept Iranian-made suicide drones. This laser weapon only has a power of 30 kilowatts, which shows its effectiveness. Significantly, China's Silent Hunter laser air defense system has achieved practical results in Saudi Arabia, successfully intercepting 13 suicide drones, and the cost of each interception was only 6 yuan. This shows that laser weapons have great potential in intercepting small drones. At the same time, the United States is also actively developing laser weapons, integrating them into lightweight chassis, and even studying miniaturized 1000 kW level anti-missile systems. This move shows that the United States is trying its best to maintain the military balance in the Asia-Pacific region, relying on the MW-class laser anti-missile system common to all three services. In general, laser weapons are cost-effective in anti-drone, anti-missile and anti-satellite applications, which is why Russia and other countries are competing to develop them. Laser weapons are highly accurate, very suitable for dealing with low-altitude drones, and are more economical in terms of cost. Russia's experience in Syria shows that drones will become the main threat on the battlefield in the future. So laser weapons are bound to become the main weapon in the future. In summary, the emergence of laser weapons marks the continuous progress of military technology, and countries are rushing to invest in research and development and actual combat applications. Competition in this field is bound to continue to heat up in the next few decades, and laser weapons will also become one of the important means to maintain national security. There is no doubt that laser weapons have already emerged in warfare. And the future military landscape will also change as a result. Chinese defense companies are tapping into Serbia's market potential, striving to further expand their activities within the country and the wider Balkan region. The Carnegie Endowment for International Peace referred to Serbia as China's open door to the Balkan region in a 2019 report. Four years later, their relationship is strengthening, as demonstrated at a Serbian government-sponsored Partner 23 defense exhibition held in Belgrade this week. 
China National Precision Machinery Import and Export Corp promoted itself as China's largest missile weapons systems supplier. It displayed laser weapon systems, including the LW-30, which uses high-energy beams to strike incoming targets, including low-altitude and low-speed drones. It is suited for forces looking to gain airspace control and air defenses. As it is able to implement hard and soft kill of threats within 3 km 1.87 miles. China's technology in the field of laser weapons has reached the world's advanced level. It has not only independently developed a variety of models, but also exported them to some countries, including Saudi Arabia. Saudi Arabia used the Chinese-made, Silent Hunter, laser system to successfully shoot down 13 drones in an air confrontation with Iran-backed Houthi forces. Demonstrating the power and reliability of Chinese laser weapons. This magical weapon became famous at the 2022 Saudi Defense Exhibition, successfully attracted the attention of the Saudi royal family and the military, and achieved amazing results in actual combat. Let's take a look at its performance and effect at the Saudi Defense Exhibition. Saudi Arabia is the largest oil exporter in the Middle East and one of the largest arms importers in the world. It is rich and powerful, with strong military needs and procurement capabilities. It is not only an important arms customer of Western countries such as the United States, Britain, and France, but also an important arms market for Eastern countries such as China and Russia. It is interested in all kinds of advanced weapons and equipment, whether it is missiles, tanks, aircraft, ships or laser weapons. There is no doubt that laser weapons have already emerged in warfare, and the future military landscape will also change as a result. As a result, the Silent Hunter performed well and successfully intercepted 13 suicide drones, protecting important targets and facilities in Saudi Arabia.